Hi, my name is Mayu Dakin. I'm a consultant ophthalmologist in the Manchester region. In this video, I'm going to be talking to you about how this little grid called an Amazon grid can save you from irreversible visual loss if you have age-related macular degeneration. I'll start, however, with some background about how the eye works. Light detecting cells in the retina at the back of your eye send signals to the brain. The brain then turns these signals into an image. The most light detecting cells are found in your macula, which is a five by five millimeter section at the back of your eye. Although it's really tiny, it's responsible for a huge proportion of your vision. It controls most of your color vision, your central vision, and seeing fine detail. Now a little about age-related macular degeneration. In age-related macular degeneration, cells in one of the layers of the macula are gradually lost and vision starts to deteriorate. In the early stages, your vision won't be affected, but an optician might be able to pick up some of the changes in your retina. At this point, you may have an optical coherence tomography scan of the back of your macula, looking for certain changes such as color changes and the presence of fluid, and the, as well as a measure of the thickness. Depending upon what you find, you'll be diagnosed with age-related macular degeneration. Until recently, there have been no treatments to delay progression. Even now, they are still not routinely offered in the UK, although we hope they soon will, will do so. It's when dry age-related macular degeneration progresses to the intermediate stage that you notice some changes in your vision. You might have trouble reading or watching television. You may find you become very sensitive to light, or you have problems when going from dark room to a light room, or vice versa. Anyone with dry aging is at risk of developing what is known as wet age-related macular degeneration. What's the difference? Well, abnormal cells grow under the retina and leak fluid into the macula, scarring it and causing irreversible damage. Wet age-related macular degeneration is different to dry in that it can proceed very quickly and needs to be treated immediately to limit any effects and prevent any permanent damage to your vision. So what is the treatment? Injections are given which reduce the growth of abnormal blood vessels. Injections need to be repeated because the effects are only temporary. Depending upon your condition and which injection you get, you could need repeat injections anywhere from four weeks to every three months. Frequent reviews are best to protect against blindness, so they're an important part of age-related macular degeneration. Close monitoring with OCT scans can pick up even small amounts of fluid and they can be inject, and you can be injected long before any vision begins to fall. So how does the amplitude grid chart work in, this, in these cases? One of the first things that will happen if there's any fluid or bleeding is that the straight lines will appear wavy when you look at them, a condition known in the medical literature as metamorphopsia. Looking at an amplitude grid chart once a week to see if anything is distorted is a good way to be alerted to anything untoward. If you notice wavy lines, get in touch with your clinic immediately, as, a, as then they'll need to inject you without any delay. If you don't have an Amster grid chart already, please find one online. It's easy to use, it's effective, and it can save your sight.